Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And with kickoff just moments away, we really should be in for a magnificent occasion. It's Germany, and they take on Spain. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre forward. If they can do that, they're a potent front three. No doubt about that. Here's the lineup for Spain. Well, it's a great system when played well, but it's very reliant on wide players who have the pace to run behind the opposition and fullbacks that are good going forward. Well, they certainly have both of those. And now they get the ball rolling. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. It should be! And it goes! An early opening statement in this match. And look at the celebrations. And so Germany get the ball moving again. Can they find a response here? And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Is she going to score? Keep her getting the touch. And she gobbles up the second opportunity. She deserves all the plaudits going. Well, I have to say, the keeper's done really well on the first shot, as you can see, but it's gone straight to an opponent and nothing she can do about the second strike. Well, a second goal for them here. Schuler. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Very quick thinking there. Corner given. Can someone get on the end of this? Struggling to get it away. 
Not a time for cool heads. Counter attacking, very much an option. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Clara Boone. Crossing possibilities. Jennifer Marojan. Body on the line. And cleared away. A corner kick it'll be. And there's the delivery. And there the attack ends for now. Pull from the keeper, and they'll come again. Giving it a try. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Who's going to get on the end of it? Not really the ideal clearance. And they could get one back here. Sloppy in possession from Germany. Well, couldn't keep it. Schuler. Debritz. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Can they slot it home? A oh, tremendous block. So the corner played into the box. Could reduce the deficit. Is it going to be? And it's in! This game very much back on as a contest. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. So Germany just one behind now. And who's to say the momentum isn't with them at this stage? Wahabi, Mariona, now with Hermoso, Mariona, an alert piece of defending, can they do something positive on the counter-attack, defenders need to cover, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end, well, inching towards half-time, and probably fair to say the fans were hoping for a little bit better than this. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, it's been a good game so far, and they've played a big part in that. But if they are to get back into this, they need to be more disciplined defensively. They've just been too open at times. Sven Yahut. Might really be able to trouble them here. Marochan. Magnificent stuff and quite the comeback from two goals down. Well, just watch this again. 
a change of pace, a change of direction and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. The first half here comes to an end. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Patrick Guijarro. Bon Mati. Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defence? Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Can they take the lead here? Real chance. And a substitution in the offing. On with the game then. 3-2. What will happen next? Alexandra Pop. Clara Boone. Well, possibilities inside the box. And lining it up. And a crucial intervention inside the box. So a half an hour remaining. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well, it fizzled out. Hoot, Pop, Svenja Hoot, now with Debritz, oh nice ball over the top, tackling and winning the ball to boot, Alexia Puteas, Aitana Bonmati, can they create something from here? Very good reading of the game to win possession back. Svenja Hoot. On to Magul. Alexandra Pop. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. Oh, surely. Must be. Oh, tremendous goal. Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Good physical play. 
Defensive efficiency personified. 15 minutes left for play. A oh, terrific pass. Into the advanced position. And a corner kick, the referee's verdict. Elects to go short. Marta Cardona. Guijaro. And Hermoso. Very quick thinking there. Jennifer Marojan. Now with Gwyn. Good looking sequence. And after the cross, defensive action called for. Counter attacking very much an option. Now, who can she pass it to? It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Substitution time it is. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Getting in there to take it away. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today.